morning. Uh, my name is Mark Krikorian. I'm executive director of the Center for Immigration Studies. Uh, we are uh, holding this briefing. Uh, we do this at the beginning of each new Congress uh, because it's, I think it's helpful given especially this time with dozens of new members uh, coming in that uh, we try to offer some context and some numbers to counteract the um, sentimentality and often, uh, uh, I was going to say untrue, but uh, it'll be a charitable to say skewed perspective offered by a lot of the special interest groups. Uh, in particular, um, at 1030, there's an event by Forward US, by Zuckerberg's outfit, uh, which will essentially be negating everything we're going to be saying here today. So we at least have to um, try to get to staffers and to offices the, um, the numbers on things like uh, workforce, on enforcement, and other things that you just don't usually get otherwise. And that's what we at the Center for Immigration Studies try to do. We're a think tank that um, examines and critiques the impact of immigration on the United States. And we're really the only um, organization that does this without a particular ax to grind. We have a view on immigration, a clear one, and we're not coy about it, but we're not making any money off of this, unlike uh, the various other groups, whether it's the Chamber of Commerce, whether it's the tech organizations, whether it's the immigration lawyers, all of whom have their research arms, and uh, some of them do some useful work, but they're all making money off of this issue, um, and we're not, uh, which uh, is in one sense a sort of a testament to our bad business model, but um, the <laughs> part of what we're trying to do is make a case for an immigration policy in the national interest. And uh, Congressman Mo Brooks from Alabama is gonna be um, introducing, giving some remarks, and then I'll introduce the, uh, the other speakers.